Hey, what's going on guys? Tim here again. Got another tutorial for you today. Doing a quick and simple one. This is the serpent spine. It's a little similar to the snake knot. Um, looks a little similar. Tying method is a little different. But anyhow, this is what we're doing today. Um, we're doing a knot and loop style bracelet. You can do this on Mad Max, of course. And uh, this one's a little short. I just did this, did this one up for like a demo purpose, but overall turned out quite nice. And yeah, I think you guys will like this one, nice and simple. So um, I learned this one from uh, Mihail. You can check out his Instagram feed down below. Give him a follow. He posts a lot of uh, nice tutorials on his on his Instagram feed, and you can definitely check that out. Um, remember, guys, if you like what I do, feel free to check out my Patreon. A lot of great rewards there. Uh, if you're really a fan of this channel, and uh, you know you'll be helping out the channel go on and do great things. So uh, that being said, let's get into the tutorial. Okay, so I got my length of paracord here. Uh, you could do it with two colors, but I like this one with a single color. And the piece of paracord I'm using may not be uh, long enough to do a full bracelet, but of course I'll have the measurements for enough paracord for a full bracelet. And here's how we're going to start it out. So we're doing this knot in loop, and we're going to make our half inch loop up top first. We're going to do that by tying a single uh, snake knot or wall knot. So let's take the left strand, bring it around the back, like so. And then take the right strand, bring that behind the left strand, and put it through this loop here, and bring that all the way through. And then you're going to close this up, cinch it closed, and this will be our loop for the non-loop closure. And you want about half an inch or so. Of course, if you size the bracelet properly, the loop will not slip out. Okay, there we go. So we've got our first single snake knot. Now we're going to take that um, knot, flip it this way, and you're going to work from the bracelet like so. So from here, you're going to start with the left strand. You're going to make a loop like this on the left-hand side and bring that strand over to the right side. And then with the right side strand, <coughs> you're going to take that right side strand, bring it behind the strand on the left, bring it over, like so, over that right strand, and then take it out the other loop here, like this. So this is what you want to have for each knot. And then we're going to pull this shut, cinch it all the way closed. And you want to keep it, keep that knot as flush as possible next to the first snake knot. And there you go. So that's the first knot. And now to continue this pattern, we're going to do the same thing again. So go a little faster. We'll make that loop on the right. Loop on the right like so. And bring this strand behind and in front like that. And then bring it out the other side. And then cinch it closed. Get that knot all the way up top here. Okay, and there you go. So there's two knots. So um, yeah, that's essentially the pattern. Really simple on this one. Let's go one more time, faster, and uh, so yeah, loop on the left, bring that through to the front, and pass that through the other side, see, simple as that. And then when you close this loop up, this one's just going to take a little bit more time when you work those knots shut. You can kind of pull on each one individually, 
close them up. And there you go. So that is the pattern you can see here. So just continue this pattern um, and wake your way down. Of course, um, because this is not in loop and we are doing this as we go, you can just adjust the size as needed. Okay, so just continue doing that all the way down. And then we will uh, close it off at the end. Okay, so I tied my length down my bracelet, and from here, it's up to you. Um, you can tie any kind of finishing knot you want. Tie the diamond knot or any other knot. I'll put a link to a bunch of, um, you know, stopper knots down below. But I'm just going to tie a simple diamond knot. So tie that diamond knot, and um, yeah, make sure the length is correct, and we'll be done. Okay, there we have it, finished. So, um, tied my diamond knot there. Of course, mine is a little short. This one's just for a demo purpose. This is a piece of paracord I had available, but anyhow, yeah, this one turned out just fine for uh, this lesson. And of course, I uh, tied my diamond knot here. You can choose whatever other stopper knot you want to finish this one off. So, this has been the Serpent Spine, a little similar to the Snake Knot. Uh, remember to check out uh, Mihail's uh, Instagram feed down below. I'll put a link to that in the description box. And uh, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next video. Bye.